Hello everyone and welcome to this new Angelic Creations weekly reading, weekly forecast for you, my angels. And thank you for, first of all for subscribing to my channel or if you're watching, thank you for watching, especially um, if you are a regular watcher or subscriber. And if you are a new one, welcome, welcome to my channel. I hope you enjoy my videos. So I'm shuffling now the Rider Weight Tarot because we're going to have a look at the energies for this week and how best you can prepare for them. Um, what to expect but like anything you your life is a free will so you can take what you want from this reading and discard the rest if it doesn't resonate with you take what resonates with you enjoy the week and uh, remember you always have the power so do not give your energy to a card or readings or, or anyone because you can always choose your own thoughts and actions to create the kind of life that you want okay but this is just for fun and let's have fun that one popped out so that's going to be your Monday and Tuesday and let's have a look what energies we have for this week Monday and Tuesday what did they really want you to know spirit guides and angels oh okay the three of pentacles okay so this is you honing your skills working on your skills and talents so beginning of the week has you wanting to go into that and wanting to um, basically appreciating yourself and wanting to do a good job and um, maybe it feels like you've you've come away from what you're good at and you're just wanting to come back into it and um, you know, kind of show the world what you've got. So you're at the beginning stages of that. Also for some of you, I'm feeling that exercise, it's like that first time that you return to the gym, it's kind of that feeling. So exercise or dance class or something physical, I'm feeling for some of you. For the rest of you, artisans and, and all sorts of business people, I see you picking up sort of the pen, if you're a writer starting to write something, if you are an artist, you know, painting, just picking up that paintbrush or that pen or putting on your dance shoes or whatever it is that you do in life um, or writing, beginning to write that business plan or writing, you know, signing that contract if you're in business. It feels like this is the beginning stage of it and you are just picking it up again from where you left off before. Or if it's something completely new, you've just decided to do it you're taking the first step towards that. So you're honing your skills and talents and I feel that you're going to be in partnership with other people. Um, you're asking for advice from other people and other people are starting to take notice of you and starting to notice and remember, you know, what you do. So um, some possible future collaborations there. Okay, so that's the beginning of the week, Monday and Tuesday. Very exciting. Nice to start off the week like that with a fresh start. Let's have a look at your um, Wednesday and Thursday. You've got the Knight of Cups. Oh, how lovely. So the Knight of Cups is very dreamy <laughs> and it feels like you're going to be very inspired by your dreams. So whatever project it is you started this week, it feels like, um, you know, you've got to pay attention to your dreams. Um, you could pay attention to them. You could be inspired by them. Um, and also you could be... Um, benefiting from doing some imagination, you know, daydreaming, that kind of thing. It looks like, you know, you're going into the heart of what you really love to do and putting that into your work. It also looks like for some of you that um, <laughs> someone who has feelings for you will contact you this week or come into your life midweek, um, you know, very slowly, <laughs> maybe very shyly trotting in there and kind of expressing how they feel about you to you. Um, so this could be very much a romantic thing. It can also be a friendship thing where someone sort of tells you how they really feel and um, just wants to have an open and honest conversation with you about your friendship or about your relationship. So this could be a colleague who's had a crush on you from afar, for example. So watch out for that middle of the week. It's, it could be very exciting and a nice little surprise. Yay! <laughs> Oh, equally, before I put this card down, equally, it can mean that um, it's you feeling that you can open up to somebody about your feelings. So if you're the one with the crush, you might midweek um, have a crazy moment and go, right, I'd like to talk to this person. Let's um, make this happen <laughs> kind of thing. All right. So for you as well, this is saying that there's a possibility and an opportunity there for you to express how you really feel about someone. Yay. Okay exciting week please uh comment and share with us how your week goes guys because this is 
very exciting. Okay, so Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday, we have... Oh, okay. So what was a situation where you were worried about money is now looking like things are on the up you know you've been you've had some financial difficulties or some issues to do with prosperity or a contract or some presentation that you were really worried about and now it's just starting to turn it's the things are starting to get better right and just to remind you this card is to say that um don't don't keep yourself locked out in the cold. Don't forget that there's a support system around you, friends, family, or even professionals who can help you. So always remember that you're not alone there um, and that other people have gone through whatever you're going through. Other people have gone through this as well and some have risen victorious and um, faced adversity and won spectacularly. So, um, you know, especially in those times when you're feeling sorry for yourself, it's saying, you know, don't. You, you have power, you have the energy, you have um, support, you know, and now with things like the internet, it's even easier to find support um, from around the world, isn't it? So, yeah, this is just a reminder that things are getting better, they're starting to get better, but you can really help yourself. You don't have to struggle alone. So, um, so yeah, maybe this new friendship that you've got here, you can sort of uh, go, hey, let's talk. <laughs> okay, but that's really nice. And um, it just feels like you'll be, you'll be more confident. It's like you're becoming more confident from the middle of the week towards the end of the week. You're confident about your feelings and you're confident about your situation that you're reaching out to others and expressing how, um, how you need that support to manifest in your life etc okay so enjoy enjoy this week and enjoy um honing your skills and getting back into the saddle whatever it is you love doing and uh enjoy the middle of the week it looks very delicious whatever happens here so um let us know in the comments guys and please as usual like this video if you enjoyed watching it it really helps me when you like my videos i always forget to like other people's videos i have to remind myself as well because i just watch it and go mm, that was nice um but yeah physically please just press a button like it and if you really like watching my videos and want to watch more um and it would mean so much more to me please subscribe to my channel. You're very welcome here. It's a safe and loving place and um, we just have fun, right? And I, I listen to your suggestions and create videos for you because that's what I'm here to do, to serve you and to sprinkle a little bit of love and light around the planet. Okay, guys, so have a lovely week and if this is your first time to my channel, welcome. And if you want to... Um, claim a free gift go to my website at www.angelic-creations.net and you'll receive the five spiritual principles to living a great life in your email inbox every month as well as other gifts goodies and treats of the metaphysical new age spiritual and angelic nature etc okay so i'm wishing you lots of love and namaste guys have a great week